So we're doing Fallout 2 today, but we did have to start a new game. And that is because I am now using the unofficial patch for it. Um, so we have a higher resolution and a little bit of cut content. And hopefully it won't crash so much. We crashed like two or three times. Well, you can't hear me. You should be able to hear me. My mic's showing up. Are you sure you can't hear me? Are you sure? You sure? Let me go look at my own screen. Do you have do you have it muted? Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, because it, it shows me mute me. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, we have to restart my Fallout 2 game because uh, we weren't very far in. But um, we had a lot of crashes. Someone suggested in the chat um, a sort of unofficial restoration project that fixes a lot of things. Um, so that's what, that's what we're doing. We had to install it, but save games are not compatible, so I've had to start over. Which is unfortunate. Uh, but we're going to pick the same same person. I'm not making a custom. I'm just going to be Chitza. Got speech, barter, and first aid. And is uh, very charismatic and intelligent. Come in, chosen one. There are things you must know. The village is dying. The signs are everywhere. Withering crops. Dying Brahmin. Sick children. There is hope, however. A slim hope. That few know of. The old discs speak of an item called the Garden of Eden Creation Kit. It is said it can bring life to the wasteland. No. That'd be horrible. What? I, <laughs> I can stop wherever I want. Quest, if you prove yourself worthy. For that proof, you must first journey to the Temple of Trials. If you survive, come back to me. We will talk more. Yeah, I can't load my old save games in your hands, because they're not compatible. One. Prove yourself. But I can make new save games. Find the Gek. Be our salvation. Yeah, yeah, it's just the different the different versions of the game. They're not it's not compatible between them. Let's go talk to Clint. Still not very helpful. Let's equip our spear. I've robbed to this last time. Let's try and speed run through this little test. Big ants. Ready. I think there are some scorpions. Oh. More ants. Yeah, there are a couple scorpions up here. I'm gonna go into these side rooms even though I don't have to just to loot the pots. It is very nice being able to see so much more of the screen because we're using a higher resolution. Uh, but it does make my character very small on the screen. I'll have to decide what sort of build I want. Melee or small arms. 
I actually really like the melee combat. I might I might go melee again with this character. Am I too tiny? I could lower the resolution and make it look a little bit bigger for you. One more ant between us and this pot. something on these poems. We just have to hope these scorpions don't poison us right now. I'm kind of inclined to just let it come to us. And I'm poisoned. Awesome. Oh well. Let's take his tail. This is maybe a bad aim. Maybe I shouldn't risk fighting this other scorpion to get those bones. Oh, there are two scorpions in there. Yeah, you know, screw it. I don't need those bones. Heal ourselves. poison anymore. You know, let's fight the scorpions. We do this behind that scorpion's back. Another spear, that's not very helpful. Okay, Scorpion didn't even see us. Nice. On to the next room of the trial. I think this is full of traps and we are going to have to go very slowly so we don't step on them. They're very hard to see. Can't disarm them, actually. Am I just going to step on this if I click this? Huh. No, I just 
just sort of touch it. They're so hard to see at this resolution. I think I'm only stuffed on one. So we have one scorpion in this room. Oops. Two scorpions. We one shot that. Because that scorpion was really weak. I think we can sneak by this other one. As long as it doesn't turn around. That's about the ants. There's another raised plate. Where is it? I can't see it at all. Hopefully we avoided it. know if we have to, but for sure we, we need to use that to blow up that door. Sneak by this other ant. Yes. Okay, got some antidote. I don't think there's any way we can sneak past this area, so let's just fight them. times when they die. Try and lockpick this, but I don't think that we can. Is it it's not even letting me? It's an impenetrable door, so yeah. Let's set a 30 second timer. Yeah, that's more enough time to get out of there. Oh! Um, crap, I didn't drop it. I'm an idiot. Hopefully, hopefully that's close enough to the door. Fingers crossed. Okay. <laughs> chest and another chest. That's that's the way out. Go grab the chest up here. This one scorpion. Is there another one right here? Yeah, okay. 
So I have two scorpions to fight through. You need to get better at sneaking. I think we almost snuck past him. Biggest tail. Trophy. Before we talk to this dude, well, there are just some ants in this room. Is it just one ant? First aid again before we talk to him, just to make sure we're tipped off. Yeah, I think that is actually max health for us. Oh, no, we can get two, two more. Okay, I guess we're staying at 25. I'm gonna drop the save here. It's a big fight. Hmm. Greetings, Chitza. I have the honor of being your final challenge. To continue in your quest, you must defeat me in an unarmed combat. Shall we begin? Uh, sure, let's party. I'm ready. Alrighty. Uh, let's not punch, let's kick. Strong kicks. We just have to hope that we don't miss too many times. Okay then. I think that the first time we fought him, he got me down to like two hit points. And I very nearly lost, so that was I'm sure some pickle. Yeah, I think we should go melee. It's just more fun than guns. Let's go talk to everyone before you do anything else. Talk to the guys in tents. Train me. 
Thanks, Jordan. That's going to help a lot. Who are you, Lucas? Close your quest. I don't even know what it is yet. I must get back to it. Male villager, female villager, a tribesman. Is this the bed tent? Yeah. Male villager. Female villager. Your nephew, Fergus. Wah, I'm really thirsty, but this well's broken. Let's see if we can move back. I repair it. Easy. What a big baby. I don't know how old he's supposed to be. Is he really supposed to be an adult like he looks? What is this? A Xander seat. Get the doggo. We can stop barking. Okay, let's go talk to um. This more beds. No, this Congratulations, elder. chosen one. You have survived the Temple of Trials. Are you ready for your quest? Of course. Then take this flask. It is from the Holy Vault Thirteen. Vic, a trader in Klamath, brought it to us. He may know where the vault is. You may also need some of what they call money. Here. Um. Is there more you can tell me? I cannot help much. So much has been lost from the long ago. What wisdom do you seek? Where is Vault 13? The Holy 13? I cannot help you. Only the Vault Dweller knew. His tales have the sound of a perilous journey. What do you need? About the gap. It is a holy artifact. The Garden of Eden creation kit. The discs promise it will make our lands green and our village prosperous. It will save us. More? I do not know. Find Vic in Klamath. We are counting on you. Can I loot these parts? Greetings, Chosen. Why does the earth before me warm to the touch of your passing? Yeah, I'm just saying goodbye and leaving on a quest. The earth sings with the news of a champion upon the land. Perhaps before you go, you would bestow a kindness? The plants of Dark Soul have infested my garden again. Many seasons have touched my bones, and I am too frail for the fight which is eternal in nature. I ask that you be my champion. You just asked me to weed your garden, but sure. May the gods bless your efforts, Chosen. May your aura grace my presence when the earth breathes clean again. Goodbye. Uh, so let's go kill this thing. Alright, that's there. Spear equipped. I guess we just go. Am I too far away? Really? The sphere has range. Whatever. Kick our butt a 
You've saved my game again. I'm gonna have to run away from this plan. Let's save. Oh, I've already acted this turn. I can't save. Please don't crit me. Ooh. Let's see. Now you have to save over this. Big fight. Awesome. Uh, get our melee up. Melee or unarmed? We could go unarmed and hope to find a power fist, assuming that there are power fists in this game. That's what saved us in Fallout 1. We got all just small guns and just pivot to guns. I feel like Melee's worth that with this character. So, 65 maybe. I don't want to be complete trash at guns, so I'll put a few points. There. Science. Lockpick, maybe? Sure. So tell him that we've weeded his garden. Ah, you return the spirit of the dweller to the world and bring a smile to the soul of an old man in passing. For this, I give you powders of healing. Remember, they fog the mind as they cleanse the body. Okay. And also, will I mix the Brock flower with the Xander root together whenever you bring both to me? May your pathways be true and your heart follow suit. I find Brock flower. Look to the north, Chosen, and the way will be open. Thanks. Uh... You're the last one that we'd talk to. Sure, we need help. I'll go find him. Let's go save this pup. Okay, so... Really weird to be able to see so much of the screen. Go grab... this Xander root. I'll go up here and try and grab this stuff, maybe. Coming, pup. Try and be a little bit stealthy, but I do want that Brock flower. Yeah, let's get it. Oh my God, surely they're going to attack me now. Why can't I pick up the Brock Cloud? There we go. Got the quick drive pixel. Don't understand these geckos. Sometimes they seem seem completely non-hostile. And other times they run at me from like the other side of the screen. 
Okay, half up. Or, uh, smoke. Aww. What just happened? Is there a day night cycle? I don't think I've ever actually seen that happen while I was outside. Get another Brock flower down here. Many, we have two Xander roots, so let's get two Brock flowers. Hopefully these guys won't mind. No! hit points. Oh, oh my god, never healed myself. Okay, let's cloud the mine. Dog, help me. Dog? Okay. Why did it even save you, dog? That's it. Maybe are they only hostile at night? Maybe, or maybe they don't want me getting too close to their plants. Maybe that's what triggers them. Maybe I just got unlucky with whatever stealth roll it's making under the covers. Your dog, dude. You're welcome, goodbye. Tribesmen. Owls. I think I think that we've talked to everyone that is named. Let's just leave. Out in here, this is just a bedroom. Nothing to loot. You guys named? Tribesman. Stand still. Tribesman. Okay, so you're the only one that matters here, guard. Yes, I'm off to find the gek. Let's go to Klamath. Hopefully this is an uneventful journey. I like the music. You wish to encounter a band of angry outcasts? I get to choose? Not really. Save, not wearing Klamath. Click 
ugly man. Let's talk to him. Hello there, I haven't seen you in Klamath before. I'm Aldo, town greeter. It's my job to greet anyone new in town and answer any questions they might have about our bucolic little burg. Welcome to Klamath. Who might you be? The name is Chitza. I'm the chosen one. Oh, the chosen one. Oh, mighty Chitza. You must be very important and powerful among your people. Surely one of your great stature would be able to help follow our custom of tipping the town greeter. Um, sure. Here's a tip, dude. Hey, here's five bucks. I'm going to use it to get some medicine for my dry throat. Consider yourself officially greeted to the town of Klamath. Do you have any questions about our fair metropolis? Uh, sure. I'm looking for a trader that sells before time things. His name's Vic. Old stuff, huh? Well, the only trader I know who trades much old stuff is Vic. Yeah, where is he? Well, now, I haven't seen Vic for a while. I don't rightly know where he might have run off to. You might talk to Jenny over at the bathhouse. She and Vic were pretty thick. <laughs> get it? Oh, I haven't lost my touch. Thanks, Aldo. I guess that's all we get from him. Who are you? Is it just a generic citizen? Is that you, child? Aha! Uh -huh. I do want to talk to you. Me, Tor! Nice to meet ya. Bugmen take moo-moos at night. Tor scared. Hep Tor. Um... Yeah, I can help. You have Tor. Moo-moo's field. Now, yes? It's just a little scorpion. Two very similar looking men, they could be twins. Alright. Are they enemies? What about these other Brahmin? Why does one of the Brahmin have a yellow outline and the rest have red ones? I'm not cannot end with hostile creatures nearby. Who's hostile? Is it the Brahmin? Let's just end our turn and see what happens. Like Chitsa, Tor Thick, Bugman, bad. Go talk to these guys. What the heck are you doing here? You here to help us or not? We might have a job for you if you're interested. Sort of job. What? He told me he might have a job for us. I said, sure, what sort of job? He tells me to get out of here. Kidding me? Yeah, I'm interested. What? Okay. What do you know about these guys? should eradicate the scorpion menace.
they can come to us. Don't know why the game's like hiccuping a little bit like that. Okay, we have an antidote. We'll just leave the poison for now. No point curing it when I'm about to probably get poisoned again. How many scorpions are there? Are there four? Four left? Five. We've only pulled one more. That's good. <laughs> Combat ends immediately starts back up. at my door. One second. So couldn't leave a package outside. Very, very, very good. We have to heal. I just realized something horrible. We got those Brock flowers and Vanderbrutes, but we didn't give them to the dude. the village. I think we can wait out the poison. Maybe. We're not doing a good job of healing ourselves. Okay, I'm not poisoned anymore. keep using healing powder so we'll just stay at this. Bug's dead. Mumu is safe. Poor, thank you.
Nah. Meat jerky. Oh, thank you. Luria 115 is now following. Thank you, Luria. shouldn't be waving a spear around in town. It's like their warehouse. Oh, okay, this must be Dick's shop. Deck of tragic cards. deck of cards for a collectible card game. Looks like it could be an expensive hobby if you got hooked. Tragic the Gathering. These smoked and dried chunks of beast flesh remain chewy-licious and even somewhat nutritious for years and years and years. So I need to get these flowers and roots back to, I don't know, that weird, I want to say that witch doctor dude, but I don't know exactly what they're going for with that. Fine. Okay, so that's the bathhouse. Jenny could be there. What's this? Buckner House. The Golden Gecko. The Beads. That door? No. Well, let's go into the farm first. Have we found something, something funny going on here? Oh, no, of course. This is, uh, if they're raising cows, it's probably just the butcher. Like the town's butcher. Large two-headed cow bones. Okay, yeah, they're just they're just ramen bones. Ramen meat just laying on the floor. Ramen blood. This. You just take someone's hammer. I guess I'm a thief because I'm just looting everyone. Here to stop me though. Sledgehammer. Thank you. Is this an outhouse? I don't know if I want anything on the floor of an outhouse. Magazine. Stuff in the back of this building. Golden gecko. So let's go into the bathhouse first. Let's talk to Jenny. We can't forget our quest. Did we go in this house? 
for you. You here to burn for some of our world famous Dunton's dry meat. Um, tell me about this dry meat. Our dry meat's an incredible blend of 11 herbs and spices. Let me tell you, it's finger licking good. Animals love it too. They'll chase you from all over to get some. Must be that rotting smell. Uh, you're not really selling it uh, to me, bro. Rotting smell. Incredible. It sounds as though you actually eat your own dry meat. Hmm. What I mean to say is, who wouldn't? Yum yum. Yeah, yeah, let's look at this dry meat. Is it just meat jerky? Oh, we can sell some of this useless stuff that we don't. Uh, I kind of think we want beers. I have five beers, my friend. We'll keep a beer, we'll keep a Coca Cola and a booze in case there's someone that like, wants them. I have an extra spear. I have scorpion tails. Oh, you sure not giving me much money for those scorpion tails. Okay, and he just sells jerky. What can I do with these magazines? So, maybe we won't sell him all of this. Some the spear, but not the tails. What's the spear by itself sell for? You can use the crowbar for opening things, or is it just another weapon? Oh, that's... Hmm. We could take another healing powder. And give him the five beers. Tell him to take two coins back. That looks good. Okay, we made some money. Okay, that's a good trade, and our response can be yes, I do. What? Yes, I do. That's a good trade. Any work around here? Alright. Those guys are not very helpful. Bathhouse. that Jenny? Is this Jenny? You're being mentally undressed by this woman. She can't even see me. That's impossible. My name's Big Nose Sally Dunton. I'm the owner of this here bathhouse. I'm afraid we just have girl bath attendants here. That all right with you? I'm just here for a bath. You just want an unattended bath, you might try the Golden Gecko or the Buckner House. If I doubt you'll find that as enjoyable. Talk to Jenny. You mean I get to be with a real live girl? Sign me up. Around the world's full squeaky clean wash. Well, Jenny. Jenny, do these two? Hmm. Okay, so. 
The only one that mentions Jenny is this one. Wait, what? Oh, did I pick the wrong thing? Tell me about your special bads. $25, that does seem like a lot. Let's save. No, not load. Bathhouse Blues. Just sneak into these rooms. Jenny. Hey there, cute stuff. My name's Jenny. You looking for work here? If you move as good as you look, you could really make some good money here. Just here to ask you. I'm looking for information about a trader. You're some traders, huh? Well, I mostly just worked for one trader. Vic was his name. He always had extra money to blow. At least when he worked, he did. See, he specialized in... Really old stuff. You know, technical thingies. Tell me more. Vic was a real sweetheart. He would go off for weeks at a time and then come back with all kinds of before-time things. But he often had to travel to the den to sell them. Not much call for that sort of stuff around here. What's the, where's the den? The den is a hive of scum and villainy east, southeast of here. I guess about a week or so. Don't remember too clearly. Anyhow, it's an exciting place. Dangerous, but exciting. Sorry to leave there, in a way. Oh, did you come from there? Did you have anything labeled Vault Tech? Vault Tech? We might have had something like that. I'm not sure. I know we did have a lot of really old stuff. Where's he now? I don't rightly know where Vic is. I know we have a house just down the street from us, to the east. He could be out trading with tribals or even in the den. For all I know. I hope he's okay. He was getting to be more than just a steady customer. I hope he comes back. Let me ask you another question. Maybe about trappers? There's not much to tell about the trappers, really. They get a few gecko pelts, or get lucky with a few golden geckos. Then they come in here to blow off some steam. Quick and not too demanding, just the way I like them. Yeah, that's all I need. Not very helpful. But hopefully that added the den to our map. You know what? Can we open this other door? Who's this other lady? What's in these other rooms? These just bedrooms? What's this? Like a, a nightstick? A club? Sure. Why am I allowed to just root through all their stuff? Oh, hello! You're being mentally undressed by this woman as well. Really, lady. I'm just going to wolf this little as well. All right. At this point, let's let's leave. Hey, look at these posters. Girly posters. Nothing out of the ordinary. Who are you? A bar patron? Short swarthy man. Hello there, stranger. Welcome to the Golden Gecko Tavern, Hotel and Trading Post. I'm Sir Jag. I run the place. What can I get you for? Um... 
like to trade? I got all kinds of things right here, kid. Healing supplies, booze, all kinds of stuff. I've got special sources, you might say. Always willing to look at a good gecko pelt, too. I'm sure what you got. Okay. Stand packs. Okay. We won't build for stand packs for a while. That would be nice, though. Do I need a club? I don't really have anything else to sell. Unless I want to get rid of beer. Who cares about beer? Okay, we'll just get 35 bucks from him. Get for Tragic the Gathering, $50. Collectible, I want to keep it. How much does a room cost? Oh, well, okay. Never mind. through this room. See what the heck's on the floor. I should probably save in case this like this blobs in. Alright. No attack. Bell Mario. back when we find some lock picks. Our patron of our patron. Tall young man with a tankard of ale. I could do with some pointers. Okay, he's going to train. Pointers, sure. Sweet science. The sporting art. about magic. Can you teach me magic spells? Sure, and Begora, I could teach you about the wee folk, leprechauns, spriggans. Sure. Who wants to hear about fairies and wee goblins and such? Have a drink. It's just the start, you have to find a fairy mound. Well, then you sit by the mound and wait until you can see the fairy circle in the dew. If you jump into the fairy ring, you'll be made to dance until dawn with the wee folk. If you survive, they'll steal you away to the land of fairy. How'd you find this out? It's in me blood, of course. Hmm. I think you're pulling my leg. Okay. Okay, he's giving me a beer. Sweet. So what? What do you actually? Pugilism. Sure, help. Oh. 
Yeah, thanks. Thanks, dude. Here's 10 bucks. Awesome. Where'd you learn to fight like that? It was not charging me. Get to Reno. Alright, so it won't tell me how to get to Reno. What did what'd that do for our skill? Look, our unarmed is now 60. Give me plus 10 unarmed. Citizen. Let's go in this ruined looking building. People, so I probably don't want to steal. How about the Buckner house? Well, howdy, stranger. My name's Whiskey Bob. What's yours? It's Chitza. Nice to meet you. Always nice to find another drinking buddy. Want to buy me a drink? Talking always makes me thirsty. Sure, Bob. Thanks for the drink, partner. Now my whistle's wet, I feel I can share a little problem I have. Hey, maybe you can help me out. How can I help you out? Well, you see, I have a little side business I need some help attending to. I have a moonshine, moonshine still outside of town that needs to be fueled up ever so often. Since a gecko done bit my leg, I can't hobble out to it before it runs out of fuel. If I tell you where it is, you'll refuel it for me? It's worth $50 to me. Sure. All you have to do is find a little shack just south of town. Go inside and dump some firewood into the still. Then come back here and I'll give you your money. It needs to be done within the next day or my batch of hooch will go bad. Ooh, we could try and get more money. I don't know, is 50 enough? Yeah, I'll do it for 65. Okay, so we find the shack, we put some wood into the stove. Yeah, so uh, what, what else is going on in town, Bob? Something about mutilations. Brahmin mutilations. We've got Brahmin mutilators, walking spirits, gigantical rats, missing people. Say the critters that look like giant man-shaped bugs, and a shell and everything, are mutilating Brahmin at night. All they find are the torn open, horribly hacked up Brahmin corpses. Is this just the rat scorpions that we already killed? Few people have seen the Bugman, but the one who's got the best look was Tor, the Buckner's boy. What he saw scared him half out of his wits, and the poor lad is a bit shy in that department already. Incredible. Walking spirits. There's a canyon just to the west of town that had a bright light in it a few months back. Ever since, every now and then, there's been a horrible squealing sound that comes from the canyon. Brahmin wander in, don't come back. Everyone's afraid to go too near. Ah oh, yes, yeah, surely a sign of spirit infestation. If only you had a competent shiny. Big rats. Well, back out of Trapper Town, just to the west of downtown, there's a back section that's overrun by rats. The further back you go, the bigger they get. Some say there's one huge, great rat spirit that's leading them all. Some say that some of the trappers won't even stay there anymore. Say it's too dangerous. Uh, okay. Missing people. Lately, we've had a couple people go missing. Crater named Vic, who specialized in pre-war stuff. One of our best trappers. Uh, so tell me about Vic. 
quite the fellow. He didn't like to work too much, so he would specialize in expensive pre-war things and then go sell them to the den, or even hawk them to stupid tribals as religious artifacts. <laughs> no offense. So he might be in the den, we already know that. Missing Trapper. The real person to tell you about the missing trapper would be Miss Buckner. She and Smiley were pretty close. He went north to look for the cave of the Golden Geckos. It hasn't been seen since. That was a while back, too. Yeah, okay. Cool. This is the Buckner house. I'm assuming she's here. Hello there. My name's Arden Buckner, and this is my place. Say, you didn't see a trapper named Smiley outside of town, did you? He's been gone too long. Never should have let him go off on that fool quest of his. I have not seen Smiley. Tell me more. Smiley and me were getting downright serious with each other. I thought I'd finally gotten him to agree to settle down here and help me run this place. But he said he needed to go off on one last quest. Quest? Well, he called it a quest. He told me he thought he knew where all the golden geckos came from. And he wanted to find out for sure. He thought that maybe it was some kind of magical spring. Or maybe a hidden cave or vault of some sort. Well, I don't rightly know what all he said, but he seemed real excited about going. I shouldn't have let him go. He's two weeks later getting back than he said he'd be, and I'm worried. Ah, uh, yeah, I can look for him. Oh, thank you. Let me mark it on your map where he talked about looking. I sure hope you can find him. He isn't much, but I still love him. I miss him more than I thought I could. Please find him for me. I'll do my best. Let me ask you some other stuff. What about talk about local events? Talk to my daughter, Maida, about that. I don't really keep track of what's going on lately. Too much keeping an eye on my own business. You barter? No, you don't barter. Well, alright, I'll go talk to her. I guess if we do borrow some, I should look at all these weapons and see what we can get rid of. That's our s so this club is horrible. 1 to 7 damage. Same as a knife. I guess what looks cool use the club. Go with club. I'll sell the knife. How's this go as a weapon? Four to ten. Okay, that's as good as the spear. Okay, we'll sell the knife. Um, what's the strength requirement on this six? So we're not at all strong enough to use the sledgehammer. These things still have uses like outside of combat. Like, is there going to be a point where I can use the sledgehammer to like break down a wall or something like that? That's my worry. What, what is this magazine? Can I use the magazine? No, I can drop it. What does it do? Didn't seem to do anything in Fallout 1 either. Oh well. Someone could be a trapper. Sounds people. This must be Mida. Questions for you? Ever heard of the Gek? The only way I know to create a Garden of Eden is through plain old hard work. Oh, okay, she hates tribals. She's a, a tribal racist. Yeah, let's not talk to her. What can we and I do you for?
Um, have you heard of a GAC? Never heard of it. But Maida has been keeping us busy. Is Maida the racist one I just talked to? She's the boss. We pay off and go find sis. What can we and I do you for? What are you doing here? Slave has got our sis. Thought Vic be having information. Couldn't peep him. Got P.O.'d. Drank like a fish. Spirits of anger and chaos pop out and now we have to pay some coin to make it right. Where's your sis? Sis went trading at another village and never come back. We and I go look for her. We'll be fine. One survivor. Dude was in bad shape. Said evil warriors came with magic torches. Fire would lick tribe warriors and they'd go to the spirit. The evil warriors tied up the rest and took off. Sis with them. Friend, we be finding her or die and trying. All right. Sounds like slavers to me. We and I know they're slavers at Din. When we're free, we're out of here. Okay. We and I know many things. Travel from Great Saltwater to home of biting lizards. The tribe's home is next to Great Saltwater. Two moons from here, friend. It's a long way. Friend, with all the spirits walking with me, not afraid to travel anywhere. We and I be glad to answer. What can we and I do you for? Slime Town. Who's we? The spirits with me, friend. They be all around. Sometimes talk. What spirit? Spirits be everywhere. Travel with we and I. Grampy Bone do most of talking. Who's Grampy Bones? Him strong spirit. Much honor carrying him. There's <laughs> a bone in your nose? Keep him close. Easier to touch his spirit. That's why he talked the most. Interesting. We and I be glad to answer. What can we and I do you for? We and I be glad to answer. What can we and I do you for? Strong on town. Oh, busy place. Bug men snatching cattle. Spirits walking. Smiley missing. We already know all of this stuff, so. Later, dude. Unnamed cattle citizen. So south of town is where the still is. Let's go. Philip is Oops, still. Well, that's not the right way. East away. Big lizards everywhere. Last way to do this is. Stay away from the big ones. Where, where are you going? Weed through all of this without getting into combat, hopefully. So I think we'll have to fight this one because he's just staring at the building and not patrolling. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. Is that another gecko right there? Can I 
really have to watch out my hit points. These guys are going to wreck me. Fight Club. I get their pelts. Everyone's talking about pelts. No one drops any pelts. This booze. Yeah, I don't fear. Thumb we build this still up. $65. Awesome. Thanks, Bob. How much money do we have now? I'm just, well, we're getting close to being able to afford that um, armor. Who was it that had that? The bartender? Oh, hello, Alex. Thank you. For arriving. Let's sell the sledgehammer. And the knife. Knight stick and spear will be enough for us. I think I can afford this armor now. I have to like give him all of my money to do it. We have 116 left. Is that sufficient? Oh, throwing knives. He's useful. I don't know. How much are they? They're not too expensive. Hopefully we can find them somewhere. Fill them all this booze. I have a Coca Cola too. that we really want to sell? Not really, I guess. And will we ever use the club instead of our spear? I don't know if we will. Whatever, we'll just do this for now. I want that armor. I feel like we really need it, so... No, 
This is a one-handed weapon by the club. I sure hope it is. Look at we look cool. So this way was rat was the the trappers and their rats. This way must be the canyon with the spirits. This way's out of town, okay. Save game. This uh, Brotherhood helicopter. We sneak by this Mr. Handy or Gutsy or whatever it is. Doesn't look like we can walk through these woods. I guess I have to go right by him. Let's just ignore him. But the M5 is invincible! Yellow reactor key card. Look at this. Okay. Who is the creator? Wait for me to close around this side and then we'll loop around again. Klaatu, Barada, Niktu. I have to take a picture of that. Go slap that in the Discord for Alex. not be able to stop it. Please don't catch up with us. Awesome. Thank you. Some sort of a key card. That's cool. down here. Hello pupper. I heard you guys like dry meats. Yep, I have dry meat. Let's 
what do what can I do with this reactor key card? Electronic security key, color coded yellow. Will people care if I walk around with this? Save. Uh, so this way, we still need to go. Lanky Trapper. Hello there, friend. Nice of you to visit us all here. My name's Slim Pickett. I talk for Trapper Town. My name's Chitza. Why do you call this Trapper Town? Well, this here part of town's where all of us trappers live when we're not out trapping geckos. Only problem about the free digs are the rats on the north side. But we have most of the entrances that part of the mall barricaded pretty good. So this was a mall? I guess it's like an outdoor strip mall. Yeah, we go to the north side. We blocked off all the entrances to the north side of town except one. I have the key to that one entrance, just in case anyone needs to get over there for any reason. But I can't figure out any why anyone would need to. Okay, so I guess if we didn't get it from the dog, we should have pickpocketed Slim and Picket. What about trapping geckos? I don't think I'd try it if I were you. You might get your hands all dirty and calloused. Anything else you want to know about? I sure wish I was as skillful a trapper as you are. I bet you could teach me a lot. I'm always happy to skill share my skill with others. With Skillshare. I can teach you some tricks for only fifty dollars. Oh, <laughs> we're running kind of low on money. Um No, nah, I'll pass. We'll come back later when we have more money. You sure have a lot of cars here. What about rats? Well, they taste pretty good if you spit roast them with just a titch of herbs. But most of the time, they can be a real nuisance. But getting worse, we've barricaded the north side of cities I've told you multiple times already. But you're sneaking through anyway. Yeah, okay. They're not going to be very helpful. Is this the door, though? Okay, I guess it is. So let's get our spear back out. Go investigate these rats. Alright. Hidden on the floor. Oh, there's something on the floor. Is that just a booze bottle? Got some stuns. Oh, 
Let's go ransack guns. See if maybe we get lucky and there's something laying around. Nope, oh, someone else already ransacked this, probably long ago. Boots. Absolutely no idea. Rubber boots. I guess I'll sell them. May I'll keep a, a pair of rubber boots. This. A wooden tape. going to do a spear and we'll just see how this goes. That has a 5% chance to hit. Do we have as high a chance with our spear? Yes. Yeah. We're just good at melee now. Quite a way to go. All right. Fight these rats. Hostile to me. Did that rat actually see me? Okay, and please don't crash. Okay. Let's let's just go kill this rat. He's sort of running away. Coward. Farming some XP with these rats. I need to slap this rat. I think I do. Let's uh, let's heal up. Just just a wee bit. Tax my ability. Maybe. Maybe before we go downstairs, I will wait around a bit. Wait till you. Oh, that's a lot of rats in this room. Do not crash game. Do 
Do not crash. Please. Let's let all the rats come to us, please. How, how did we miss twice when we have a 94% chance? I think these percents are lies. Rats still just being a coward. There we go. Huh. You will not escape justice, rat. see a dead, strong peasant. Obviously very strong. That's why he was killed by rats. Only peasant. Wait till you... Oh my god, those rats almost killed me. I didn't even realize it. One perception. From what? Go downstairs. We have rocks everywhere. Range 12. Okay, it is. Okay, let's try and throw rock. Maybe this will tell us whether or not throwing knives will be a good idea. So we didn't really get a chance to throw this, so I'm not going to throw it when I'm at point blank range. Okay, I guess... I guess we were pretty close to leveling. Oh jeez, what do we want? More skill points for reading books. Whole experience level, that sounds really good. Command attention by just walking into a room. We already have really good charisma, I don't think we need that really. This, we might actually just because I'm so trash at the game and might need to be using healing stuff often. We 
just take Swift Learner because we are early on and this would be helpful. Okay, we'll Swift Learner. Okay, we'll get this up high enough that hopefully we'll be able to start doing like aimed attacks and not nerfing. Let's see, I want my lock picking a wee bit higher. Oh, it's going to be a little bit higher. Throwing? Sure. Turn off those notifications, jeez. Let's go get all these rocks. Just pick up everything. That's what you do in games, right? You just pick up anything that isn't glued to the floor. What if I did want to throw a rock at point one range? I would barely be able to hit. Because it's a completely different skill, it's just not going to be useful. We want to make an aimed attack. But I don't think our melee skill is high enough just yet. I want these numbers higher. I can throw the spear? That I did not know. Maybe it would be good to have two of them. Alright. I think we'll unequip these rocks. So many rocks everywhere. Another sledgehammer to sell. Knife. Just come, come to me, rat. But I guess that rat didn't actually see us. Game. Let's save. Bad rats. I guess we want to move up here and get that knife. Didn't even see you there, little buddy. How does that as a weapon? We don't have enough strength. Club, club it is. Club is our backup weapon. I don't know why I want all the rocks. A rock collector. We're gonna go back to Arroyo and tumble them. Sell them as uh, you know precious stones to the other. Tribesmen. just by killing rats. Very 
Magic Art then. Okay, I guess I have to go all the way around to get there. That's fine, we'll kill every rat on this floor. We'll just be 25 XP, but... So that's going to take a lot of rats to get enough XP, but... There's the ladder down further. Get these two rocks. A rock. Go this way. sell this stuff before we go deeper. I guess I need to not focus maybe so much on these yellow outline things. Because it doesn't outline like shelves or furniture we can interact with. Now do we want to avoid these radiation barrels? Probably. Just swoop in, pick up the rock, and we'll get away from those. Not irradiated, right? Good. Okay, we'll go back up. You'll sell these extra weapons. There's still, I think, a couple of rats alive. But I can't be bothered to scout them. we can maybe trade with Slim Picket. That'd be convenient. Some questions? No, I don't actually have any questions, so let's barter. Wait, he'll sell me the key? For free? Okay, I mean, I already have it, so... Here's a sledgehammer. Here's a knife. Here's a crowbar. Here's 19 rocks. He'll, he'll give me nothing for the rocks, so... And here's a boot. I'll keep one boot in case I... Well, you can have it. It's on the house. Does that get me even one stim pack? No. Dang. OK, 
Okay, yeah, never mind. I'll trade with someone else. Someone has a little bit more money. We'll go talk to that bartender again. money do you have? Wait, he has... That's leather armor? It look like my leather armor. Am I not wearing leather armor? What am I wearing? It's leather armor. Black heavy leather jacket. Why does this leather armor look like combat armor? Looks like all leather apparel. How much is it? It's incredibly expensive. Is that really leather armor? No, oh, this is leather. Oh, okay. Leather armor and the leather jacket are different things. Got it. That's what I want to trade. Nothing else, really. He doesn't quite have enough money. What's the cheapest thing here? We can take it back. 185. 60. So hold on to the knife. go back to Arroyo at some point to make sure we can give in the uh, trade in those Brock flower and Xander roots. But for now, let's just wait till we're healed. Maybe it'll be daytime even. Until healed. day. I hate walking around at night. And hopefully those rats have not respawned. Thank goodness that child didn't follow me all the way in here. This floor rats too. Large white mole rat. So we have another ladder up. Loot is on the floor. Some ammo. Wooden support. 
wooden support. That big for I crush them by removing this wooden support? Let's say it. That'd be amazing. Bad rats. Okay, that was not a wooden support. But that is okay with me. Let's go get some more ammo for it, I guess. It's 10 millimeters, I guess. Okay, we'll, we'll steer clear of the big rat. Just clean up this area, get this ammo down there. Oh. oh, we can see where some nearby enemies are. We have a slightly bigger rat here. like all the way to this other room? Maybe, maybe we'll go up here first. Take a look around. What is that on the floor? It looks like there's something weird on the floor here. I think Kyler's gonna tell me what that is. Okay, maybe we'll, we'll come back up. to get that ammo. Maybe we'll try and kill the big rat. I don't know. I don't think I don't think we're ready for it, but Okay, we have a big chungus rat. Tough big rat. How long does this take to put them down? Can't take these things down, but we definitely can't take the big rat out. They do a lot of damage. We are getting wrecked. And the game is not happy right now. I think we do need to just uh, get out of here. He's, he can kill us in one turn if he gets both attacks. In. Game! That's probably a horrible time to save. No, no, it's not safe. No, we'll save. I can't make up my mind. Do we heal? Do we just do the heal? Let this rat can kill me.
Get out of here. Can we outrun the rat? I don't want to use a healing powder. Please don't attack me. Why well, is every turn going to be like this? Maybe I should lower the screen resolution. Maybe that's what, what it is. Just can't handle maybe the size or something. Did we not climb up? I don't have enough AP. It made like the climbing up sound. We have to get out of here. How many AP is this to climb up? Can I poke this rat once? Oh, I killed it! I killed it. Great success. Get out of here. Boy, this is a harbor. Oh, I can't even rest here. I guess that makes sense. Oh, well, you know, can we can we first aid ourselves? Or are we too tuckered out? Fail to you. Five hit points. Okay, so we're not on death's doorstep anymore. But I just have to remember those tough pig rats are tough. Like five hit points on attack and they can attack twice. this rat. Just a regular rat. Where'd he go? He has a knife and a Xander root. I don't think I can take him, not with 13 hit points. Whoa, don't don't go that way. Go go pack up the ladder. Heal up all the way. Maybe I'll even take the time to go back to Arroyo. Though I'm sure if I leave for that long, all the rats will respawn. Go hang out on the surface. Finish healing up. Why is it that sometimes I can pathfind all the way from like the other side of a map? Other times it seems like I almost need line of sight. Okay, cool. Let's wait. Hmm. Well, if the rats aren't respawned after this, then. Maybe they just don't respawn at all. No rats. Okay, I think that they're still dead. So it probably is safe for us to go back to Arroyo. Let's 
pee do we have? What did we get from killing those pig rats? Not enough. Something like 2,000 XP, a normal rat gives 25. So it's going to be a while. We'll go to this whole side and see how we feel about trying to take on Mr. Big Rat. fighting these big, big rats. Big, big rats. Was that just a regular tough pig rat, or is that an even bigger rat there? It's a big silhouette. Okay, we'll see what it is, what it calls it. A mole. We couldn't take out a pig rat. I don't know if we can take out a whole rat. It seems bigger. Okay, we'll wait. We'll let it come to us. I'm gonna try stabbing it in the eyes, I think. It's just a little bit too far. Go for it. Really? Awesome. Critically hit for six hit points. Okay, so they only have six hit points. I don't know why, so it's just big. It's just real big. I guess it's just a mole rat, a regular mole rat, so it's not a tough mole rat. Or... It's so dang big, though, if it has so few hit points. There's a locker down here. I think I want to loot that. Yeah, I did say pig rat. There are pig rats. This is a pig rat up here. It's not a tough pig rat, though. It's a regular pig rat. Oh, thank goodness. Stem packs. Two pig rats up here. Neither one is tough, so we might be able to handle it. Where did you come from, sir? Uh, I did, I did. I said both at different times. There is a very large, like, albino rat god on the level right below me um, that I am I'm putting off attacking. Well, this small rat has more than six hit points. Oh, I don't want a gun. But I still have my club. Pig rats are big rats, I guess, themselves. So I don't know. They're big pig rats. Let's get our club here instead of the gun. Okay, we have three pig rats. Oh, 
four four pig rats, okay. Well five, but I think I think that one's out of aggro range. Yeah, I don't want to fight four at one time, so let's hope that just this one comes to us maybe. Pull them away from the group. Quite get them in the eyes very easily from here. Let's try it. Nope. Is this one so much harder to hit? Bonk. Oh, that was a tough pig rat. Okay. These two are normal. I don't know what the other two are. I don't know if any of the others are tough. Not, not as tough as me, but... One more time, oh cool. healing next to the room of enemies. Yeah, let's see if we can aggro one of them. Just slink back into this hallway and hopefully it's only that one that'll come. This one's hard to hit as well. But we did it, we killed him in one hit. Okay, so maybe we do just take take a chance and try and hit people in the eyes. Even though we're maybe not very good at it just yet. These only give me twice the XP of a normal rat. Which is kind of trash, but... They just make the cutest sounds. this other one just yet. It's a normal big rat. Yeah, let's just try it. We're gonna take him out quick though because our health is kind of low. Crit me. We should be good. I just need to run, I think. We'll flee from the rat. Are we exactly the same speed as this rat, or are we slightly faster? I think that we're slightly faster. So maybe maybe we'll be fine getting away. Come on, I just want to end this combat and heal up.
Can I just end this? No. I was hoping if I was out of line of sight, I could just end it. Melts my blood. Heal up time. Failed to do any healing. Got a little bit of healing. I don't think we're gonna be able to do any more. Strain going to kill us. I'm not so bad at this. Need to put more ranks into it, I guess. Well, I'm not getting the message like I can't heal anymore. One hit point. Okay, now I can't heal anymore. Bad rats. We're saving. We're gonna go up here and we're gonna kick that rat's ass. Back here, you filthy rat. It's just normal attacks. It's like called shots. I feel like we aren't really good enough to be aiming for the eyes just yet. Okay, yeah, we have one more pig rat, and then we're out at that door. What is that thing? I want that. What is it? A tool. Painting various useful tools. Sure. Does it serve a purpose? Or is it just for selling? I'll hold on to it. Maybe it helps with repairing. <laughs> Hate that they make cute little yelps. Okay. Let me to have to use the diamond on this door. Build the floor. This is no harm in just trying this. We can always use the dynamite. Okay, so I've jammed it. We cannot pick it. Set this timer for 30 seconds. Done. Let's drop it. Remember to drop it this time. See? We're learning. Walk back and forth. <laughs> Boxes, an agricultural card. Okay, we'll go upstairs. Oh, come on! There we go. 
if the car mechanic of the year suddenly appeared next to you, both of you could not fix this rusty heat. Is this the highwayman? Yeah. You find a fuel injection system in the back seat. You can 200 XP. No plus my leveling. Okay, 1300. Not the best. Let's rest so we're healed, and then we'll go back down into the rat lines. equip our gun if we're going to fight that big rat. Anything else in here? No. Doesn't look like it. minutes I'm probably gonna go get lunch. Rats are not fun. Okay, so big rat is coming for us. Can we shoot it? No, we don't have enough AP. So run away. Ing smell fear stink on you. He moves very quickly. Let's try and hit him in the eyes. Three hit points. Oh. I think we just have to move three spaces so he doesn't get multiple attacks on us. And we just have to hope that we get really lucky, I think. Always heal up if, if it starts going too badly. Get a few steps away. Smack him. steps away. Are his eyes not like a weak point for him? Because we don't seem to actually be doing... Okay, we did do more damage to him this time because it was the eyes, but yeah, we don't in general seem to be doing too much more. Please die. Smell no such thing on me. King kill big noise one. I'm big noise one. Uh... I think I need to heal at this point. 
use up one of these instead of stim pack though. Maybe we'll make like a final stand here. Yeah. Oh, I don't have enough APs. Oh yeah, if he gets two attacks each turn, it's, it's bad. I critically missed and dropped my weapon. What? Um. Well, carp. Please, please die, sir. Oh, we did it. We did it. Let's pick up our, our dang spear. King Rat is dead. Loot King Rat? No, we can't. You see the remains of a rat god. God among rats. Still pig rat in here. And maybe like a couple of smaller rats. And maybe uh we couldn't sneak by. To us, please. No, he doesn't care. He isn't actually aggro. Pick up this knife. And please let me pick up the Xander root. Okay, let's get out of here and never return. It's a tough big rat. Just leave. When we get to this 50 XP, maybe I shouldn't run away from it, but. Five XP, okay. These were three rats. Let's go sell all of our spoils. Dang close. And we have to kill, I don't know, like a dozen more rats. It's like 20 rats actually. Let's see if this guy's thankful for us killing his rats. Good riddance to rodent rubbish. Just a regular Pied Piper, ain't ya? Thank you. 
That's not a whole lot in the way of things, but... It's great. Nothing. Of course it's nothing. That's it. Maybe I can pathfind anyone on the screen as long as I'm actually on the screen. Yeah, I just can't pan too far to the side. Go back to the barkeep. I think we've taken care of all of our problems except for finding Smiley. Did he always have that rat away? I feel like that's new. I'm tempted to just sell this gun. Keep the knife this time. Here's a Nuka Cola. I don't want it. Here's a crowbar. Can the crowbar help open locked doors? Maybe I'll keep it. Here's a boot. It's free. That's like all that we have to sell, actually. Unless we decide to sell the gun. Which we might, but not this juncture. I know if maybe him having rat away was a hint that I've been radiated. Where can I get a room to stay for the night? Tell me. I need a room. What will a room get me for $25 that just waiting till he lives doesn't? Wait till I'm healed. The problem are just out there grunting. They're grunties now. Alrighty. Let's leave this town. Go look at that um gecko cave. Maybe we can find Smiley. I mean, no, we'll go back to Royo first. We will get the um we gotta make us a couple more healing powders. I don't remember if I had a name. I'm assuming he did since he was like a talky person. Jeez, there's geckos and plants here. And a Barak flower. We need that. Okay. Can I just sneak past all of this now? I guess I do need the XP. Maybe I should fight them. Let's fight the geckos first.
tough little gecko. Oh, he's a tough one. We'll just stab. Ouch. Critical. Okay, one down. That was how much XP? 60? Okay. We might as well fight them. Are you tough as well? Just a normal little gecko. Spore plant. Spore plant. Wait for him to come to us. Two steps away. Come to me. It's just slightly out of range. It's so stupid. Let's just walk up to it. I mean, it's still just slightly out of range. So, okay, so let's move five steps away. Hopefully, he should be able to walk up to just within range now. Okay, only 55 XP for that for some reason. Sneak up behind this plant. Do they actually have facing? Talk to it? What? I'm not talking about plant. These give me a lot of XP. I should take the time to fight them. Let's heal up. <laughs> I need to get better at healing. This is pathetic. Tell me night time. Can we loot any pelts off these geckos? Or do I need to have better like outdoorsman skill? No pelt. Like if people are talking about pelts and I can open up the inventory around these, I'm assuming there's some way to get their pelts. I'm just gonna go back to work. Done fighting. Time to heal. Hear this one. Ah, chosen. My garden is well. How is yours? I need healing. You are awesome. well. Thank ah, you. chosen. My garden is well. How is yours? I have some plants for you. May this be of no use. Thanks. Uh, how's your dog? A really fun trip. Like, why can't I pathfind to here? I don't understand. I can pathfind to here.
leave this joint. It's just a lonely pig rat. Let's say hi to him. Oh, sorry. Said hi with my pointy bit. Uh, yeah, I'll help these farmers. Oh, that's a lot of geckos. Maybe this was a bad idea. Uh, hmm. Okay, some of them are armed. Game. What are you doing? So this hasn't crashed, but with the unofficial patches and stuff, it may have, like, I'm getting this weird stuttering that didn't happen before. Tough little geckos. Oh, these are all tough little geckos, and then a golden gecko. Uh, guys, you might be on your own fighting these. Why aren't the children running? Are the geckos going to kill the children? Is that a thing? I can't take this. Sorry, sorry guys. I'm leaving. I'm leaving you to your own fates. Figure out why I'm getting this stuttering. It's like when too many things try and pathfind. I hope we'll have that worked out next time. I'm only in like 15 minutes. I'll go get lunch. And I'll try. I'll try and figure out why this is. Maybe if I change it to like 720p. Besides making my character a little bit larger and we'll see. More hopefully, um, maybe that'll help. Actually, no, that won't make anything larger for me. I'll just blow it up for the stream, I guess. Oh. Is this tough? It's just a normal little gecko. See Smiley. I guess we can explore here. I'm very worried about getting irradiated though. Because I don't think I can afford the rat away. How could we kill that? Oh, thanks, Kuma! How how is your day been? Your weekend? <laughs> uh, I'm actually probably not going to stream that much longer. Um, I do need to get lunch at some point. See if we have any loot on this one. No. Ah, <sighs> uh, stinks. Yeah, luckily things have calmed down a little bit at my work, so it's been a little bit less stressful than it had been. These big golden geckos are going to wreck me. Let's we can go here. I still got a club attacking. Not a club, a knife. 
This is how it usually is, I guess, isn't it? He does like nine hit points in one hit. Or is that just because it was a crit? I think it's just because it was a crit. I might, I might be reloading here. He doesn't die this turn. Yeah. I have to run away. I'm dead. Game, don't crash. Please. Not even the carrion eaters are interested in your radiated corpse. Wow. All right. We have to go all the way back to Arroyo now and get our healing powders again. I need to remember to save more often. Yeah, it's those golden geckos just destroy me. Really prefer not to fight them. Ah, Chosen. Heal me. You are well. Ah, Thank Chosen. You. Make me some powders. May this be of no use. Thank you. Let's leave again. I'll save maybe at the entrance to the toxic cave. Because I, I think we might be able to get through that cave just if we take them one at a time and don't aggro multiple at once. Try this one more time. Band of angry outcasts, no. Fight this one gecko. Just waiting for us. Save. Save game, please. Save over this one. Toxic cave. Yeah, let's see if we can pull just just one. Go back here. Yeah, awesome. We just got the little one by itself. Do it from here. Your critical hit for one hit point. The bruise will look nice. Maybe the scars will make good party talk. Doesn't sound like much of a critical hit if it was just one damage. The little gecko was critically hit for ten hit points, tearing some of its slimy skin off. I never look at those descriptions down there. It's kind of amusing. Wait. 
I'm not aggroing them, right? Okay. We'll save after every combat. How about that? And I heal myself. Ooh, I probably shouldn't use the same save slot for all of this. In case I get, like, incredibly irradiated in here. So one golden gecko. Can we take it? You critically missed and hit random. Awesome. When day is done, we're going to have to wait and heal up. Can Pokemon is on the floor? I need to heal. Yeah, use one of our new powders. Powders don't really do a whole lot, do they? I'm dead. No, oh, thank goodness he missed. His powders are trash. We'll use them just to just to get rid of them. Oh! Okay, that was all worth it. Uh, let's get our melee weapon skill up higher. 105? Yeah. We need it. We need it. That way we can start doing aimed aimed attacks. I, I am I am radiated. Let's wait out here and heal up a little bit. Let's save the new slot. Rattle. Can I even wait here? No, I can't. Okay. Well, that's not ideal. Heal anything. Can't see where the stupid geckos are anymore. Okay, we're almost actually at full health. Okay. Maybe we can do this. There's another glowing gecko right there. We cannot afford to fight him, I don't think. I want to get to that door, though. Why did we have to aggro that one first? I think that we have to fight this one to get through. That stinks. Yes, let's just go do it. We did just say it, so if he wrecks me, then that's that's fine. Go for the eyes. Twelve hit points, nice. Oh, it's slightly too far because yeah. we pushed him back with our attack. Let's move away so you can't get as many hits on in on us. No, oh, we should have just moved closer. Whatever. Let's bring them away from the radioactive barrels. Wait, is he not coming here? Oh, is he blind? 
maybe? Because I hit him in the eyes? Crap. I've wasted it. He's fleeing? Okay. No, do we have to walk into this acid? Whatever it is. Goo. Put on the rubber boots. Durable enough to keep out sludge at least for a while. Am I using them? I got no idea. We'll take those if they're useful. Rad X. We take them before exposure. Okay. So that's not going to be super helpful right now. I'm saving yet another slot. Okay. Heck, a smiley. up there and end up fighting two of them. We have to kill this one. Please die. Wow, that did a lot of damage and it's still not dead. <laughs> you can't run from me that way. I mean, maybe you can, actually. You're <laughs> really fast. What happens when it runs to, like, the edge of the zone? It really has to turn around. What? Oh. Come back here. Wait for it to come back here so we can hit it again? Or should we leave it be? I think we can sneak in and get an attack on it. No! Leave it be. I don't know if I just need to have these in my inventory or if I need to have them in my hot bar like this, but. Smiley does not seem to be over here, is he? In this corner? Oh, there's a ladder down. Okay. Take care of this. Oh, I have enough AP. Okay, okay. We're, we're, we're fine. Oh, no, I don't have my knife equipped anymore. Please, hit. Was not as effective as I was hoped.
Okay. Nice. How'd you like that, lizard? Okay, we killed it. Awesome. Wish I had any idea how many rads I'm taking. Whoa. That's not smiley, is it? I Maybe mean, it's just small. Oh, that's a rat. I think it's all this. A dead dog. Are they all these golden ones down here? Please, please die. Causes blindness. Unlucky for him, lucky for me. No. Okay, maybe we don't have to worry about him for a while. Oh, jeez, we have to make it all the way over there. So that's this is an egg. Glowing egg shell. This sucks. I think I should maybe just take this. Even though I'm already radiated, maybe it'll prevent it from getting too much worse down here. I think I want to go up around this side. It looks more slightly less hostile than going through like their egg chamber. There's one over here, right? Please get left. Nice. I'm gonna have to use up some more damage down here. Three steps away. I'll get lucky and blind him again. Okay, so he's blind now. Is he going to run away or come to me? Awesome. Then the combat. Let's pick a healing powder. So we have three geckos along this upper edge. Do I need to have the boots like out when I walk across this stuff? Let's just wait for someone to aggro, right? No? Like this one, surely. Just need to make sure we get them one at a time. We don't get any lucky kids. Fleeing. I 
Still sneaking, we're still in combat mode. Is this a vault? Where, where are you going, dude? You're gonna go solo then now. Oh my god. What are you doing? I'm just here to play with the computer. Oh, okay, we have to go help him, I guess. He's totally dead. What are you doing? I want to. Uh, why did he just run out? I want to like talk to him, you know. Okay, we have to go help him, right? At least he has decent armor. It looks like. if I tell it not to. I'm just just to folk, pay attention to me. Stupid. Miley, you're an idiot. Okay. Hit one. It doesn't say he's blind, but that's some okay damage. Yeah, they aren't really doing any damage to him. Whatever armor he does have is pretty awesome, I guess. I just want this over with. Oh, I'm attacking the wrong one. You'll regret setting a foot in here. I'm pretty sure this is their home. Critically missing losses next turn. Awesome. Oh, I'm on. I'm dead. Died. Your village is lost. And the game like doomed totally to die of starvation. Right. Okay, sure. So now we know that when we approach Is this really the last place that I Yes it is. Alright. Let's go take care of this guy. Uh, but now we know that when we approach Smiley, he's just going to run out and like Leroy Jenkins. So they will try and stay further away, aggro them, and take them out one on one. So he's not blinded, that sucks. Let's see what happens if I don't have my boots equipped. Because I'd like to have my knife equipped for this. Uh, 
like we're doing a lot worse in this fight this time around. One gecko might kill me. He's blind, okay. I'm going to equip my knife. Eat a rat axe. Eat a healing powder. Now let's go down the pit. There should be one right here. Nice, did we get lucky? Well, it's not blind yet. Maybe, maybe not that one. Nice, he's dead. <laughs> one gecko down, a million to go. I've never saved enough, right? And not blind, but that is okay. Is he dead? Okay, didn't say I killed him here, but sure, he's dead. Here. No, no. I should have kept attacking him. He's bad. Okay, no, he's just gonna run away from me now. That's fine, that's fine. I just don't want him sneaking up and attacking me from behind. This is fine. Getting a lot of good hits. Okay, so I guess that means he does not wish to fight me anymore either. Don't want to get too close. Turn around. Let's just go, let's fight with him uh, up here. Nice. Okay, it's blind. Finally, get out of here and help. Ow! Does a lot of damage. Okay, I need to heal. Use up another powder. Okay, he's blind. Yeah, get out of here, you. Hello there, stranger. People call me Smiley. 
I'm sure glad to see you. I thought I was going to die here for certain. I'm hurt too bad to get past those dang lizards on my own. What are you doing? I always caught more golden geckos north and west of Klamath than anywhere else. So I figured all the golden geckos lived someplace up here. Darn tootin'. Looks as though I was a little too right. I got in here okay, but then one of those dang geckos got behind me and damn took near, dang near took my leg off. I just barely made it over here. Well, I guess they don't like to crawl through the goo too much. Can't say as I blame them. It sure burns if it gets on your skin. That doesn't seem to stop them from licking up the darn stuff like it was Buckner's best. Well, enough gum flapping. Well, let me get out of here. I figure if I can join you, we should both be able to make it out of here okay. I sure could use the help. Yeah, Arden's gonna be glad to see you again. Let's get that out. Does this elevator door work, actually? Am I going to have to come back here at some point to further investigate? No. Let's just get out. Let's get out. Looks like I first get the generator working. Can I do that? Please don't go into combat. What can I do here? Science. That's a big negative. Maybe I'll have to come back here at a later point. Let's just get out of here. Let it run away, Smiley. I have no no reason to go fight them all. I guess it, XP would be a good reason, but... Oh well. Are we gonna be sent right back here to go kill them all so that they aren't plaguing Klamath? Maybe I should be killing as many as I can. Like taking or destroying these eggs. Ooh, uneventful exit. See, Smiley, all he had to do was casually walk out of here. Change the beasts. Yeah, this one's gonna. No? Oh, okay. Let's see, totally tamed. Oh, oh, okay. I didn't get to see what he was saying. What the heck is that? Umbra tribe. Oh, okay, that's where, um,. Mr. Weird Dude can comes from. Go downtown. And the Buckner place. I lost my rad resistance, that is a-okay. You I need to talk to. You're the one that found my smiley. Thank you, thank you so much. I just don't know what we could ever do to thank you. Oh yeah, uh, you consider Sulik's debt paid. Thank you. Yeah, maybe, maybe Sulik will adventure with us. Why is she crying?
Did she actually like him or something? Maybe she was just being really sundere. Um. Yeah, I think he will be a lot better off away from her, but I don't want to sort of insult her to her face. Yeah, we'll, we'll visit back here some other time. We be here. Tell me about We and I be glad to answer. Would you like to come with me? We're there. Yes. Grandpa Bones say we might find sis with you. I sure hope so. Not just Grampy Bone, all tribe spirits. Grampy Bone just wiser and stronger than the rest. Let's ease on down. Heck yeah. What you be needing? Talk to you about your gear. Oh, can you consult the spirits for The me? spirits are sometimes hard to understand. They see things you and we can't. Okay. Get out of here, and I'll talk to him about his gear. I wish we could take this woofer with us. What you be needing? Tell me about your gear. You got it, friend. What kind of weapons do you use? We be good with fist, spear, big hammer, submachine gun. We be a handful. Indeed. I'm very confused, though, because one of those things is not like the others. Like, sure, submachine gun. Combat control. Oh, this is, this is rad. Okay. I wish there was something like this in, um, Fallout 1. Kill melee weapons. Use best weapon, sledgehammer. Use best armor, leather jacket. Uh, be defensive? Be coward. Okay, I can't make him a coward. Custom. Pack the strongest. Can use stim packs when hurt a lot. Distance charge. Run away. You need the tourniquet. Be careful not to hit me. Yes, that's very, very important. Okay, we can't make him more cowardly than this. He'll okay, just always go after the strongest. He won't. I can't tell him to go up against the weakest. I think it makes more sense to go for whoever has like the least hit points, but whatever. Any drug, any time. Okay, we'll let him use stim packs. We won't get him addicted to other drugs. This, this is totally awesome. Very happy with this. What can we give him? We could give him the gun. Give him a stim pack. Um, hmm. If I give him things, can I get them back at a later point? Or is this going to be like Fallout 1 where I have to steal them back from him? It's like, I'd like to just give him... Yeah, I think that we can just trade things freely. So, here, you hold on to the gun, my man. Go back in combat control. Okay, so Sledgehammer is still his best weapon, but that's fine. Sweet. Found a friend. I think I need to go get lunch. So that's probably a good place to take a break, throw down a save game, 
We have Sulik. We are heavily irradiated, and we have Sulik. Sulik plus rads. And hopefully next time I will remember that we need to do something about those rads. Um... But yeah, I'm going to um, go get lunch. I'll be doing some more stuff on um. Why are they all down there? I'll be doing some more stuff on um Tuesday and Thursday. So later, uh, probably not Fallout though. I don't know what I'll be playing. Um. I might do more Project Zomboid or Dead by Daylight or something like that. Yeah, peace out. Have a good weekend, everyone. Thanks, Ace. And thank you, Kuma. Daleks.